Hey guys, it's Apple Freak 22 and I'm going to show you how to make a widget. Um, so first, download Dash Code. If you, your computer already has Leopard installed, you got one of the newer ones. Put in the second installation disk, go to Optional Install, and then go to Developer Tools, and then Dash Code or something like that. And it'll be in the Developers section under Macintosh HD. Okay, so when you open it up, it looks like this. So choose custom, and today the widget we're going to be making is stickies. Okay, so now you have your interface. I can't go over it. I'll go over it really fast. Um, inspector library, your front and your back of the widget, the attribute, the default image, the white the icon, workflow steps if you don't know how to do anything really. Okay. So what we're going to do is delete the text. So first, how do you want your stickies to look? So I'll give mine like this, kind of like like this size. Then go to the inspector if you want. Click on this. You could fill it in. And I'm going to do salad and then glass. And then make it shine. Put up the tongue a little. The horizon. And then. Okay, so something like that. You could change the corners. Okay. And then do this right. Okay. Here, actually, I'll just. Okay color okay so now you've made that okay so now let's say we want to write stickies because I mean you don't know what it is so go to the library parts then just grab text or you could do buttons I like doing buttons because they look like I don't know they look cool then resize that if you want and I'm gonna write stickies Okay, I guess I won't use a glass button. I'll use I'll use a lozenge button. Size it how you want. Sticky. Stickies, inspector. Let me change it to okay. one. Okay. So now we have stickies, okay? Make sure you have your info button on. Now you could change the X where it is. Just line it up, or you don't even have to. I like lining it up. Okay. So now let's add the text to play so you can actually write on it. So you're going to go to library, scroll down, text area, drag that on. As of right now, you're, you have to keep the text area white. Sorry about that, but it's the way things gotta go. Okay, so put something like this. Okay, now if you wanna change the font and everything, you have to do it now. So go to inspector text. So I'm changing it to at least 14. So every time I type, then for the color, I want it, my text color to be this color. Okay, um, change your font. You could do like special fonts if you have. I think we're just gonna go with something simple like Arial. 
and that's basically it. Now go to the back, and you can move your your little code around. Develop. You can delete this if you want, but I like keeping it on there. And make sure you keep on the done button, or else you'll be like stuck. Um, you can add in some text or whatever you want to do on the back. Um, so now that we've done that, let's go do design the widget icon. So yeah. So now. So now I just uh, I don't know. I'll keep it less than like that. So click the run, and there's how your widget's gonna look. And right there, right there. you could now write on it. If you click info, it's like that. Okay. So now to get into your um, dashboard, it's really easy. Just do deploy widget to dashboard. Name it sticky. And then just move it around, go it like wherever you want. There you go, you got a widget. So thanks for watching. Uh, more videos to come. Bye.